Welcome to the demo video series for Configure IT. Unleash the hassle-free way to build bug-free mobile apps in the quickest possible turnaround time. In this video, we will view how to configure multi-data source picker view. It is used to provide multiple selection lists in a picker view. Switch to backend and configure the API. Make sure the structure is properly defined. Mention the key named data source and key named data here. Click on the data source icon to add the data sources. Here we can view the data source already configured. Moving forward to the control list, drag and drop multi data source picker on the main screen. And from the properties action window, enter the desired title for the picker. In this case, multi data source picker. Under the action window, select click and set API call as action. Select data source as multi selection and save it. From the properties window, click to enable should picker data source load after click. This will allow the data to be loaded after the click. Select object. For picker selection receiver ID as receiver. Save it. Set key name to data source and select the data source that we configured in the back end. In this case we will select component 1, component 2, component 3. Similarly set key name to data and switch to back end to view the configuration. and enter data 1, data 2, and data 3 respectively. So that's it for the configuration. Let's check how it works. Open the Preview It app, and click on the most updated icon. So here, by clicking Multi-Data Source Picker, the data will be loaded and we can select multiple values. So this was all about configuring multi-data source picker view. For more information, visit our help center. Stay connected via support ticket portal or live chat, where our support team will assist you. Keep configuring. Thank you.